And I'm here with Jeff at AMPG, and we get to talk about this 13 years or more working with Edge. So we know about the reliability. We know about service and support. We know about growing a company. Absolutely. And you yourself have been here, I believe, 17 years or more, right, Jeff? Yep, 17. So let's get into AMPG, what you guys have done with Edge and how they've benefited you. Mm -hmm. So the company started off um, in New York where it was just buying and selling. It was just accessories. It was some machine tool products. Um, they moved manufacturing out here in 2004. I started later in 2006. At that time, the business model was small to medium runs and we would import a lot of the larger run quantities. 2007, 2008, we made the decision to start manufacturing much more in-house. So we brought in a lot of high precision lathes and with those lathes, we needed reliable bar feeders. So from the first high precision lathe we brought in, came with an edge bar feeder on it, and we have truly never looked back. You have parts that are 40 cents, 80 cents, so it's so important to you to be able to run these machines, lights out, with a minimal amount of operators because of how this costs. It's not $80 a part or $800 a part. Correct. How does this affect business as well? How has this supported you? So we're a very, very thin company, like everywhere, the management, on the production floor, sales, everywhere. So we get absolutely everything we can out of who we have and what we what we run. With the limited amount of people that are available in the first place in this industry, not to mention that are skilled enough to run these machines, um, we need to set these up, we need to pat them on the head and let them eat, and we need to come back to completed parts. With the Patriot and the FMB bar feeders, that's what we get. We don't want little hiccups in the bar feeder stopping a 24 hour run. We wanna be able to basically set it and forget it for a lot of these products. Ah, uh, you're so right. You mentioned the quality of the machines being able to help with that also. We're focused on bar feed today, but the importance of coming in on a Monday and having parts that are reliably finished instead of scrap parts the entire time right now. Would you mind saying how many machines you have and how many employees are running these machines? So on our in our Swiss department, we've got 44 Swiss lathes, um, all with edge bar feeders on them. And we have at this moment, I believe eight people setting them up eight and 44. Do that math, my friends, do that math. I remember the days where it was one person per machine loading and unloading. Was it ever like that here? It was. When we first started, we had no magazine bar loaders. Uh, we had a few Swiss lays, but they were basically manned and they were very short runs at the time. But the, the bar loaders are just one less thing to not worry about. How's the service and support been through Edge and through your local representation? The service has been fantastic. Um, as far as um, actual on the ground service, we get texts in from St. Louis or wherever their call is. It's usually within 24 hours we can get somebody out here. Even faster if we have something that's really catastrophic gone wrong. Um, as far as parts, anything we can get overnighted from St. Louis so our in-house technician can repair that. Um, any application support, any programming that needs done, we can usually take care of that by wire through an email some sort of download to the PLC, something like that. So the support has been great from just from the get go. This is my friend, Jeff. This is American Manufacturing. Look them up, AMPG, an amazing company here in Indianapolis. Do you have a website where we can close this out where someone can reach out to you to learn more? Yeah, it's just ampg.com. It is that easy sometimes, isn't it? Well, thank you all for watching MTD. Jeff, thank you so much for joining thank me you. on camera.